Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. Today I'm going to be checking out another live performance from the one and only Morissette. Um, this is going to be Never Enough from The Greatest Showman. Um, now this is actually a song that I have heard previously, so you guys know in the past um, when I've listened to and reacted to some of her pieces, some of them are, you know, covers, and others are ones that are her original works, and then there's some that are covers that I've actually never heard the original song before, so... This time, this is a cover, and I have heard the original and various uh, interpretations, so... Definitely curious to see what she does to bring her own little spin on it. I'm sure it's going to be fantastic just based on everything I've seen from her so far. This is another live performance on Wish 107. Um, I really do like this format because it, it's, you know, there's something to be said for big stage performances that, um, I don't know, that, that, that really like adds a dramatic flair to it but i actually also find that more pared down performances like this where it's just you watching the artist singing and it's just their voice and presence that needs to kind of captivate you um i find something just particularly impressive um about that so i like that she has so many of these um online and i'm excited to check this one out too so hopefully you guys are ready to come along let's watch this together all right never enough morissette here we go Trying to hold my breath. Wish. One of seven five. The wish gets me every time, I swear to Can't let this moment end. You set off a truth. Getting loud now. Can you hear it echoing? Still too little These hands could hold the world And it'll never be enough Never be enough For me Never, never Never, never <laughs> Never for me For me All the shine of a thousand spotlights, all the stars we steal from the night sky will never be enough, never be enough. Towers of gold are still too little. These hands can hold. For me, for me, never enough, 
lives there. What? How is it over already? I... Alright, I just need a second. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Okay. Alright. Okay. <laughs> well, um, that was Morissette's performance of Never Enough on Wish 107. I... I don't really know what to say right now, guys. To be totally honest with you, I'm gonna hazard a guess here. I I won't know for certain until I go back and actually do the edit, but I'm gonna make a guess and say that this might be one of the reactions I've done where I am speaking the least, uh, where I have the least actual concrete things to say during the performance. Um, if not, if not, like, where the, I'm the most speechless of all time in any of my reactions, I, I don't know if you could gather from watching, and I do apologize, because it's like, alright, uh, okay, hopefully you, you got a sense from whatever I was doing with my face, with my facial expressions, and just how captivated I was by watching this, and how emotional I was getting, because I was, I was actually choking up, I was getting teared up watching this um hopefully you'll get a sense from that even though i'm not using my words of how much i absolutely loved this performance um you know this is a powerful song like i said i've heard performances of this song previously and it's extremely powerful and in the past when i've heard it i've also like really felt it um i don't know what it is but I don't know if it's the the lyrics or, you know, just the overall feeling of this song and what they're trying to convey, the message they're trying to convey, but it's something that has always really resonated with me personally. But something happened when she took the performance um, and made it into her own here where it just left me kind of, like, wonderstruck and um, emotionally... <laughs> Just, just paralyzed, um, and I'm still kind of in that, that mindset right now, even, which you can probably tell because usually I'm babbling on and on about a variety of things, but I just was completely swept up in it and emotional, and the feeling, the feeling that this song and her performance in particular conveys for me is hard to kind of put into words because it's that that feeling of such immense overwhelming heartbreak of love longing need like all of the most intense and painful emotions of real love just kind of comes flooding in but at the same time there's also a, a triumphant feeling behind it which is an extremely strange combination of feelings but but that to me is what I get from this song and from her performance of it in particular and so it was kind of just leaving me extremely extremely just choked up emotional like I, I'm gonna go back and listen to it and and I'm, I'm probably going to cry <laughs> even more because I'm trying to keep it together. But, you know, when I'm not on camera, I don't, I don't care. So, but I thought this was beautiful. This is absolutely, so far, my favorite performance from her. And I don't think it's necessarily the best vocal performance from her that I've heard yet. In, in fact, I'm, I'm certain that this... Even though this was an excellent vocal performance, of course, beautiful, captivating, as always ridiculously impressive what she's able to do from just sitting there in front of a microphone. And even in the things that the physical performance of it in, that you could see in her eyes that it almost seems like she was feeling the same sort of things that I was feeling. Um, but even... Putting all of that aside, obviously, in terms of the performances I've seen from her and reacted to previously, there's things that she's done vocally that 
you could consider to be more impressive. Um, but nonetheless, to me, this was the most impactful um, and by far my favorite of her performances so far. So I absolutely loved this. I'm really curious to hear you guys' thoughts as well. And uh, again, I apologize for my struck speechless sort of state and me trying to put this into words here. There's only been a few reactions that I've done where I've kind of gotten into this this place of just overwhelmed befuddlement because of how great it is and this is this is absolutely one of them. It might even be the most, like I said, the most. So I want to hear your thoughts. Um, how, how did you feel when you first heard this performed by her? And if you've heard other performances, the comparison between the two, if there is one that you can give. Um, and in relation to her other songs, how do you feel this this performance sits with you? And just, just general thoughts that you have. And as always, if you have other recommendations for performances from her that you want me to check out or of anybody else, please do let me know in the comments. Thank you guys so much for joining me and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.